I first uncovered my passion for teaching at home. It must have been the captivating stories that left my parents' lips while shiny copper pots of pungent Bosnian coffee were passed around. In between little sips, they taught me tongue-twisting words in our native language, Bosnian, and explained the challenges they endured during the war in ways a textbook never could. These were not just any tales, but oral histories, a term I would later come to learn. These stories were history lessons. They taught me the experiences my family had endured and how my roots were intimately intertwined with theirs. Pictures, old passports, and letters accompany these stories, giving me a deeper glimpse into my identity. My coffee conversations were my first peek into an archive, where history and teaching melded together to deepen my understanding of myself, my family, and my community. As the first member of my family to attend college, and as a student on full financial aid, I quickly buckled under the weight of Harvard and its expectations. I was convinced that the only way to measure my success was by the salary my postgraduate job offered. But I still felt a longing for that kind of learning that had accompanied the bitter aromas of coffee and cigarettes from my childhood. I wanted to teach, and I wanted to teach history. <laughs> 